Ashley loves teleworking. She can work from home in a relaxed environment, away from the usual office hubbub. Tomorrow is telework day, and Ashley is really looking forward to it. The next day, Ashley settles into her favorite couch to start working when she finds that her internet connection is down. She has a deadline to meet and desperately starts looking for open Wi-Fi connections that she can use. She notices one called Ben Davis. Ben is Ashley's neighbor. I'll call him later and thank him, she thinks to herself as she connects to the Wi-Fi hotspot and starts working. The hotspot is a trap. A hacker in a nearby apartment set it up to lure unsuspecting people like Ashley to connect to it. The hacker gathers swaths of sensitive organizational and personal information from Ashley's work devices. Later that day, Ashley calls Ben to thank him for his life-saving Wi-Fi. Ben is surprised. He tells Ashley that he doesn't recognize that Wi-Fi hotspot and that it doesn't belong to him. Ashley is concerned. She calls her organization's information security officer, Alex, and tells him everything that had happened. Alex quickly informs his team and asks them to investigate. The news isn't good. In a meeting with senior management, Alex informs everyone that all the information exchanged by Ashley's work device earlier in the day was most likely compromised. The legal department starts looking into the organization's legal obligations while Alex and his team go into damage control mode. The organization braces itself for the bad publicity to come. Working from home is really convenient and can be a great change from the usual grind. But it's critical to know that the chances of your information getting compromised at home are higher as well. Make sure this never happens to you. Here are some tips on how to stay safe. 1. Never use an open Wi-Fi connection to connect your work devices when you're working from home. This simple mistake can completely compromise the device. Use your own internet connection and keep a data card as a backup in case the internet connection goes down. You can also use your smartphone as a hotspot and connect to the internet. 2. Always try to connect your work laptop using a wired connection. Wi-Fi access is convenient but easier to break into. 3. When using Wi-Fi, make sure that your router is set up to use WPA2 encryption with a strong password. Also make sure that you change the default username and password for the router to a stronger one. Remember, even if the default username and password appear strong, they are freely published online in router manuals and guides. 4. If you're using a wireless printer at home, remember to secure it just like you'd secure the Wi-Fi router. Otherwise, the printer can be hacked, and anything you've printed can be stolen. 5. Never tamper with the security settings in your work devices. It could violate the organization's policy, but more importantly, it can expose all your work information and your personal information to the bad guys. 6. It's very important to keep your Wi-Fi router fully updated and patched at all times, because that's the door to your home network. 7. Keep all your work devices locked away safely when you're not using them. If you have kids at home, it's definitely a good idea to keep that place a secret and out of their reach. Be smart. Be aware. Be secure.